Hello everybody and welcome back to another new and noteworthy mod review. Today we're going to take a look at two really interesting mods that dropped in the Giants Mod Hub for February 2nd, 2021. And both of these, I have to say, are somewhat kind of quality of life improvements. Uh, these are going to be PC only, uh, mostly due to the fact that they have scripts and as a result, uh, they are not going to be available for console players. Uh, but the first one we're going to take a look at is Tools Combo. So I'm pretty sure there is, or at least in 17 there was, and I suspect there is in 19 also, just I don't know what it is, a key command to basically lower and raise all attachments. There was in 17, I know for a fact, I just never could remember what it was. Well, that's what Tools Combo gives you. Let's demonstrate this. So I've got a Kloss Axion 800 here, and this is about the best thing I could come up with with respect to multiple things uh, attached to the tractor that would need to be unfolded, raised, and lowered. So typically, you know, in normal farm sim, you would hit X, and then you would lower it, then you toggle to the next one with G, you hit X, you wait for that, or you just toggle back, you hit X, and while that one was going, you toggle back up here, you would hit V, then you would toggle back to the back, and you'd hit V, and then everything would be ready to go, then you would toggle up to the front, and you'd hit start, oops, you would hit B to start, and then you'd toggle to the next one, and you'd hit B to start, and then you'd toggle to the next one, and you'd hit B to start, and then you'd be ready to go. After all of that, right? But what if I told you that instead of doing all that, you could just hit left control B. And now I've turned everything off. Or left control B. Or left control X. Would I rock your world? Did I just rock your world? Let's see that again. Left control V. Okay, I'm unfolding everything all at once. And lowering it. Left control B. you unfold left control B okay we're out of sync there we go now we're fixed and now we're off mowing and windrowing I should have picked a bigger tractor I didn't realize how much horsepower I would need but anyway now left control B Turn it all off, left control X, folding it all up. Let's take a look at this mod in the mod hub. So we can see, this mod allows you to turn on off and fold and unfold all implements attached to your tractor at the same time with a single action button. Press left control B to turn on and off all of your implements and left control X to unfold and fold all of your implements. Now I had just happened to try left control V to raise and lower and that also works. So that is really, really cool. It's mod by Viscount of Modding. Again, it is PC only because it is using scripts to do this work, no doubt. Go ahead and jump back into the game. We'll go over it one more time. So again, not showing up in the F1 menu, so you're not going to get prompted on how to do this, but basically, pay attention, we're going to use left control X, unfold everything, we're going to hit left control V to lower everything, because everything was already lowered. There we go. 
left control B, turn everything on. And off we go. Turning everything on and off. Left control B to cycle it off. Left control V to raise. And left control X hold. And again, without all of that awesomeness, we would basically be left to hit X, hit G, X, G, G, X. And then, oops, I accidentally unfolded that. And then we want to lower that. Then we toggle to V, V to V, lower that. And then we basically need to turn that on. And then toggle G to turn that one on. Toggle G, that one on. So, yes, vast quality of life improvements for PC players. Let's go ahead and take a look now at our second mod. Left control B to turn everything off. Fold it up. And the second mod we're going to take a look at today is kind of a, a special purpose mod and a really, really kind of debated about should this mod be in the new and noteworthy because I think it's really only, only going to appeal to a a much smaller subset of the audience and that is photo mode so when, when I take screenshots I'll basically go in and I'll turn off the HUD I'll try to get you know I'll try to get lined up on a screen on a, on a shot that I like and and then basically hit F12 on the PC keyboard to take a screenshot or I just hit control and then um, print screen to basically get a screenshot. And I paste it into paint, and then basically that's how I do things. I've been doing screenshots basically for the entirety of my content creation career. Well, this mod gives you photo mode. The way you turn it on is you hit pause. Pause the game. So whatever button you use to pause the game, for PC players, it's typically the pause button. Okay, and when you hit pause, you get this little HUD that shows up. So W, A, S, and D, I'll move your camera around. Okay, so you can kind of really get in on this or zoom way out, whatever. Okay, like pretend that you're a creeper watching, watching the action from the bushes. And then up and down, the keyboard keyboard up and down buttons will raise and lower okay we can do it from here and then your number pad four rotates six rotates five rotates down eight rotates up and then seven and nine rotate and then the o button will reset that and when you think you're all said and done with just the right just the right shot okay you hit the enter button return and it basically the HUD goes away and you hear camera click camera shutter and your screenshots taken now where does it put it let's take a look so I'm going to try to zoom in on this as best I can but where this puts it is under your documents my games farming simulator 2019 screenshots and then a new folder photo mode is created and your screenshots are basically put into there here's one i took a little bit ago so i took that screenshot a little bit ago just in testing and then here are the two screenshots I just took that's where your screenshots are saved and you can really get some interesting you know angles on this thing you really couldn't have couldn't get any other way really kind of get up close or really to kind of look inside of how things are working I want to get photo mode of uh, uh, who knows 
back of the uh, the guy's head. Now I'm really bad with these controls yet. They're, they for me they don't make some sense. Some of this stuff doesn't make much sense. We could get a kind of an overly shoulder shot. That. And these are kind of screenshots that really you can't get any other way. And I found this really zooms out quite a fair bit. So there's lots of potential use cases for this for content creators or just folks that like to take screenshots. I've seen some really, really amazing screenshots from folks playing farm sim. You know, they're pretty Pretty photogenetic, or not photogenetic, photo, uh, well, they're just pretty creative with how they take their photos. And as you can see, we can really get zoomed out far more than you can, obviously, with the in-game, in-cab camera. And, uh, well, you need to enable flight mode uh, in order to get screenshots zoomed out this far, uh, typically. Yeah, I can see this being used. Quite a bit, quite a bit number of options. Now left shift will speed up the camera movements. Also, you know, it's it's a it's a free roaming camera. We we're not tied, we're not tied in any way to the tractor. Go underground apparently. Now I did manage, leave it to me to break it. I did manage to somehow wind up where the camera was just uncontrollably rotating among a vertical axis as if I was holding down the eight key or the five key. Um, and I basically broke out of that by just getting out of pause mode. But you can see we can way outside the boundary at this point. Close up of, the, of these boats. Nice big close up of the boats. And that could be your, that could be your screenshot right there. Yeah, and some of these controls, for me, I just, it, I'm, I'm having a hard time with it. There you go. That is photo mode. Now let's take a look at it in the mod hub. Really not much to say here. We've got photo mode. Photo mode adds a movable camera to the game when paused by Viper GTS 96. Again, this is a PC only mod because of its use of scripts, no doubt. There really isn't much more to say other than kind of what's been said already for it. Download it. Give it a try. You might find some very interesting use cases that you really hadn't thought about up until this point. So then, again, to get out of the mode, you just hit pause, and boom, you're taken right back to where you were. So guys, I hope you enjoyed today's new and noteworthy. Leave me a comment. Let me know what do you think of the two mods you profiled here in today's new and noteworthy. So until next time. Happy farming. Be sure to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell.